put on top of a reservoir, which is hoped will reduce massive energy bills racked up by water companies. Before we come to the end of today's show, I would like to share with you an extra postcard from the UK. Hey, this is Tom, this is Tom Brio's show, and I got this Fifi SDR working with this Bontito, I pronounced that wrong again, software that comes with it. And the radio is working great. It's right now, it's 9.48 a.m. in Florida, Eastern Daylight Time. This is China Radio on 9.570 megahertz. And it's booming in. I mean, booming in. I haven't tried one of my other radios to um, see if it's good on everything. But this SDR is working great. I'm using my MFJ vertical, 31-foot vertical antenna uh, connected directly to the SDR. And I've tried a couple of frequencies and stations are booming in. Um, let me turn the... And my recording, um, the audio is not as good as real life. So keep that in mind. Plus, I'm using some cheap speakers on my computer um, to provide the audio for from this SDR. So you can see over here is uh, another station. Let me turn the audio, I mean the speaker back on. Making much larger, but there have been two limiting factors. To build a much larger farm would have to take a great deal longer. One thing the company didn't have okay. was more time because the subsidies which the British government gives to good thousands. I'm manually tuning. Also, building a much larger solar panel farm on the reservoir would cost a great deal more. Let me uh, go up to WWE. Uh, 10 megahertz. This is, um, it's off by 0.1 megahertz. That's probably an offset I need to put in. I did see some instructions on how to do that, but I haven't done it yet. I can barely hear WWV. Early this morning when I was uh, getting the software working, it was about mm, 7.30 a.m. I was getting WWV in very good, plus I was getting the WWV at Hawaii on 10 megahertz. I'm using my headset microphone right now, so you might not be able to hear the audio from the radio too good. WWV is pretty weak. Let me try 5 megahertz. Eh, that's dead. Too late for 5 megahertz. Let's try 15. Oops, went the wrong way. I, I really haven't learned how to use this software yet. Yep. There's 15. Let's go down. No, 15 is not too good. I was surprised to get uh, 10 of radio this late in the morning. Let's go back down and see if I can get uh, anything else down that 31 meter band. Okay, there's something right there. So those of you who continue to follow Alex Jones, you do it at your own peril. He's a troublemaker. And he had no business left today on the streets trying to stir trouble. Any sensible person 
That sounds would say, like um, this is not the hour. This is not the day to be out on the streets yeah, with a megaphone like a yelling in people's faces. Turn down. The tension is. That sounds like the broadcast out of Tennessee, and you can see from the display here, it's a pretty strong signal. Nine point three nine five. See what else we can find. Turn the speaker back on. Let's just quickly go down to the amateur radio band. So the amateur radio uh, band is you know, working great right on this receiver. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely excited about this receiver to say the least. I just wanted to do this quick screen capture of the thing operational, and uh, we're going to doing going to be doing. I got to calm down. I'm kind of excited here. We got it. We're going to be doing some more shows on this receiver and this software when I learn how to use this software properly. So anyway, if you enjoyed the show, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.